Now to continuing coverage from the lakeshore. Getting ready to break ground Monday, the people behind a large waterfront development in Muskegon are already planning another new addition. Adelaide Point's been billed as a marina com community with more than 100 boat slips, condo buildings, and more. But when it's finished, the property could also house a hotel. 1300 Sides' Charlie Tinker spoke to developers and has all the details, but it's still very early in this process, Charlie. Yeah, yeah, Kirk, this is something that would essentially happen after the work of the bulk of it uh, is wrapped up on the rest of the site. When it is done, though, they're thinking the hotel would be the largest that they're aware of, Mass Timber Hotel in the world. More on exactly what that it is in a moment. But first, check this out. What you're seeing is uh, pretty basic, just a massing, as it's called. So the color wouldn't be white. You can see there's no texture there, but you do get a sense for what the hotel facade would look like in the end. More than 100 rooms inside behind these walls, plans for a restaurant as well, a pool with a swim up bar, also access to the walkways and the marina in back uh, for the public. All of it mass timber, which is basically layers of wood that are glued and compressed together. It could be stronger than steel and is more environmentally conscious than many of the alternatives out there. Dr. Emily Liesma sees it as a kind of nod to Muskegon's lumbering days and a chance to spotlight the place they love. Ryan and I are very passionate about, you know, bringing some more development um, and prosperity into Muskegon and also just showcasing what a beautiful place Muskegon is to be. Um, but I think, you know, having a hotel here provides the opportunity for people to drop by for a weekend. And that's the view around back. Now, the project is so new, it doesn't necessarily have a name yet. So for now, they are just calling it the Hotel at Adelaide Point. Lisma is hopeful they're going to be able to break ground on this next year and open in 2025. In the newsroom, I'm Charlie Tinker, 13 on your side.